So this connector, the real rear wheel speed sensor on my VW 2016 Passat has been causing all kinds of BS trouble on my instrument cluster. I have ABS lights going off, uh, stability control, cruise control disabled. Um, it appears that it's this part. I pulled it from right out of the back of the brake assembly here. It was impossible to get this connector out. Luckily, I removed that little screw. It was a inverted hex screw. And once I got this out, the whole assembly popped out, uh, popped out and I was able to release this damn connector. Literally impossible to get out. I had to like plug a flat head screwdriver in that hole to release it. So I'm about to clean this up. Actually I already did clean it up with a brush and I'm about to put it back in, reset the codes and see if that fixes all my problems or not. Okay so finally I was able to change the rear left wheel speed sensor and uh, <clears throat> fix the problem right away. All the dashboard lights are gone. No ABS, CSP, or airbag stuff. Um, <clears throat> but it took a few tries to get the correct part. First I uh, tried from AutoZone. There was a Duralast one and uh, it did not work at all. It gave me another code that it basically said uh, that the uh, sensor was unreadable. I mean the data from the sensor is unreadable. And then I finally went with OEM part. This is ATE. That's the part number right there for the rear left. And uh, guys make sure you go with OEM parts because sometimes with the aftermarket parts you'll be wasting time, money, and it's just going to be aggravating. Get the OEM. The dealer wanted $133 for this thing, but I got this online for like $40 from a really good place uh, uh, in, the, uh, in the Google search, shopping search, I mean. To demonstrate uh, the sensor works, I have my Ansel VD700 <coughs> device scanner here and we can go into the brake section manually select the brake section and <clears throat> we can read the data stream read it for the sensors. Now what I'm going to do is basically drive the, well, I'm not going to drive it, but I'm going to make it move in my driveway and you'll see that the, uh, that the values do update. Indicating that the sensor is finally fixed. Thank you and good luck.